I like the legend behind the phoenix and the way that it, you know, rises from the ashes and it's something that I can relate to uh, just in running and, and even in life I've, you know, I've had a lot of bad races or had a lot of, you know, tough times where I've always just found a way to rise again and, you know, kind of come from the ashes like stronger and, um, you know, everyone can, everyone has a story and everyone can relate to it and I like, you know, I like knowing that no matter what happens I'll, I'll always find a way to rise again. Well, there's probably two things. The first thing will be um, the fact that all my family will be there. Um, my mum, dad and my brother. Um, that'll just be so exciting for me. Um, I can't wait to have them there and, you know, share the whole experience with them and see them at the finish line and, like, we'll probably all cry together and <laughs> be really excited. Um, so that'll be just... I don't know, I, I can't even picture that yet, but it'll be really exciting and I'll play some strategically along the course, so <laughs> there's always someone to give me a bit of a cheer. Um, the other thing is that I've heard that um, the food halls, like 24 hour, will call like, whatever you want, whenever you want. So I'm really keen to go and check it out after the race. <laughs> Yeah, I think the best thing is just to be, just to be really flexible. Like long distance races, you can't. It's 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 like the race. It's, you have to invest a lot of time, but you have to be prepared that you know, day in day out, you can do the training, and you might not see results instantly, but you will see them. Mm. I think that's the main thing is just be patient.